Women over 45, these are the five most important morning routine exercises you should be doing every single day to maintain your health and improve your organ function. All right, exercise number one. This is gonna be a two-part video series. Part one is here. You're gonna do the shoulder press. Shoulder press and on your toes. Shoulder press on your toes. From a side view, you're gonna go shoulder press on your toes. You're gonna do this for 50 times, okay? So what does this do? Besides helping you strengthen your shoulders, relax your shoulders, most important thing, breast health. You've got lymph nodes here. You need to stimulate those lymph circulations. This helps stimulate that lymph circulation, right? Which improves your breast health. Exercise number two, you're gonna click like a chicken, right? Click like a chicken, click like a chicken, okay? You can just do it like this, or you can make it more advanced by bouncing up and down, right? So what does this do? This stimulates the nerves that are going down to the side, which affect your liver and gallbladder function. Super vital for women, right? So click like a chicken. Make sure you follow me on Got bloating after Thanksgiving? Eat some dirt to reduce that bloating. No, I'm not actually telling you to eat dirt. But if you remember when you were a kid, you probably did eat some dirt, right? But we're gonna use that concept, right? What was in that dirt? It was good bacteria, right? So you want to, when you have the bloating, a lot of that gas is produced by your so-called bad bacteria. So you wanna input good bacteria to, over, to, to control that bad bacteria from overgrowing. So what are good bacteria? Well, they're probiotics, right? You can get any type of probiotics. Um, I've got three different types right here. Now, which is the best probiotic? It's the one that you take. That's the best one, right? There is no single probiotic that's going to fix everything. That's a lie, it's a myth, right? You wanna rotate your probiotics. Too much of a good thing can turn into a bad thing, right? So too much of a good bacteria can actually cause a bacterial infection into your intestines. So make sure you rotate them, all right? Get ready for Christmas. Avoiding activities because chronic pains interferes with it? Let's stop it by doing these three coping tips for your chronic pain. Learn to prioritize exercising. Exercise can produce endorphins that helps you feel better by suppressing pain signals while also improving your mood. Track your pain level up to 1 to 10. You should be aware on how tolerable the pain you're experiencing and address it immediately to your doctor in order for him slash her understand your situation and provide the treatment you can do. List all the activities you've done. Some activities can be a trigger for your condition, so be careful of what you're doing and know your triggers. For more health tips, follow Achieve Integrative Health. Migraine headaches, there's the two method relief. So there's two ways I'm gonna teach you today on how to relieve your migraines. Migraines, you know, sometimes they're, a lot of times they're coming from the back of the head. I would say back of the head, right? You feel like it's called the occiput area. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna find the back of your ear, okay, there's a little bone, and you're gonna go one inch backwards, one inch backwards on each side, and then you're gonna pull your head up, okay? Pull your, you're gonna press on it, press on it, and then push up and hold it for 30 seconds, and then release and see if your migraine gets better. Second way, this is your head, this is your hand, obviously. <laughs> the hand images the head. So the back of this area right here is this area. This area right here corresponds to this area. So you're gonna find that tender spot and you're gonna press on it, okay? Hold it for 30 seconds and then move and see if your migraine, it should instantly reduce your migraines, all right? You can do both hands. Make sure you follow me here on TikTok. Does it feel like your loved ones are sort of not feeling well because of their chronic pain? Help them to cope with these helpful tips you can do for them. Talk to them constructively. Positive and caring talk is a powerful tool for feeling the comfort that they need. If they feel like they can't handle their pain anymore, help them to find a way to ease it. Help them to be active and engaged. Help them to distract themselves from pain by doing fun activities. Find them a new hobby or pastime so that they won't be isolated and let them cope with their pain alone. Help them to find a support group. Try to reach out to the people who have the same condition as them in order for them to feel understood and valid. For more health tips, follow a tired eyes. Health. Do the three finger rake 
to instantly brighten up your eyes. So everybody's working, many people, not everybody, but every, a lot of people are working at, at home due to COVID, right? And so we have, we're staring at the screen, we're staring at the monitor every 24 seven. We're actually working more, we're looking at our phones, our iPads, blah, 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 right? So you're gonna do three fingers, right? First finger, first pressure point right here. You're gonna use the index finger. And then the middle finger right here. And you can rub them like this, okay? While I'm teaching it to you. The third one is right down here. You're gonna go and rub here. So remember, one, two, three. This increases, and then you're gonna rake. You're gonna rake, 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 okay? Do it for 30 times, okay? So every 30 minutes, you're gonna rake your eyes, okay? Close your eyes, you're gonna rake them, right? And that should instantly improve blood circulation to your eyes, and your eyes should actually feel rejuvenated and brightened, right? Do this every single day to, to help your eyes. Follow me on YouTube.